All right, welcome to the first YQT Wednesday. Tyler has been a friend of mine for a number of years. One of the reasons I really wanted to hang out with him and feature him, he's got so much knowledge of the local area and the history of Thunder Bay. Um, he's out very often, uh, almost every weekend I would think, just exploring, looking for new places around Northern Ontario to photograph and just to hike and explore. You should definitely go check out his Instagram feed at Facing North. Uh, I'll link it on here. Today we ended up at Mink Mountain. Conditions were not the greatest, uh, but we just decided to go for it and make the best of it. Ended up with the view clearing out a little bit in the end. So check it out, follow along. Hope you enjoy. I thought we'd stop and take advantage of a cool little, um, I don't even know what this is. What What did you call this, Tyler? Uh, a mesa. A mesa? A mesa. So it's kind of, you know, like a disc shape, like in Utah, you kind of get those. So, oh yeah. Yeah, this whole area kind of has a lot of them, they're dotted around, farm fields. I like so, it. Uh, it's a good vibe. Uh, yeah, so I don't know, we're halfway here. Beautiful mesas, uh, this whole area is kind of dotted with them. And uh, yeah, they're, uh, these ones are pretty uncharted, but uh, the one we're going to is right by the lake and uh, should look pretty nice. We got our man Dave here in the corner. Yeah, that's right, taxiing. Woo, I was man. taxiing. He's looking up topographic maps. Topographic maps. Ensure we're gonna get there quickly, that's right. efficiently, and with a minimum one death. So like if two of us get out, that's a win, I think. So let's keep going. <laughs> All right, we're at Mick Mountain with Northies and uh, we're about to hike this baby. Oh! <laughs> so, maybe bring in the snowshoes. so don't step off the beaten path because this is what happens. All right, I I got a little aggressive here and thought I could just start walking. I literally haven't even made it onto the trail yet. We're off to a good start. You might notice us sweating a lot. It's because of the natural fit and warm Insulating properties of the Northeast Took. Cool down, no matter what you got to do. Recharge, refresh. Oh, moisturizing, yeah. Got to cool down, no matter what it takes. Cool down. You betcha. So I just, in about 30 seconds, I led us down the wrong trail. And this is the reason I do these things with people like Tyler, who come out here often enough to know the difference between a what trail is it? Not a trail. A trail and not a trail. Fun fact, a giant tree fell in front of the actual trail. It truly makes it seem like it's not a trail. And uh, it's really easy to get kind of lost, so you gotta go against your instincts sometimes. Or just don't listen to me. So, uh, there's no view. We, uh, we had to trek up here. Luckily, it's not too crazy, so, uh, you know, we're still getting a good little hike in. Still pretty warm, as you can see, and nice, but yeah, it's, uh, Zero visibility and uh, snowing. But that's part of the fun, right? You don't know what's gonna happen. You just gotta get out there, wearing your Northeast gear, stay warm, like this insulated <laughs> Northeast t-shirt. <laughs> and uh, yeah, still a beautiful day and we're still seeing some, some, uh, some islands out here. So yeah, we're doing all right. That commitment level, I like it. That Commit attack. Committed to the shot. Nature's pillow. Ugh. I'm telling you, memory foam's overrated. Memory's overrated. Tell me about that too. <laughs> All right, it's been uh, it's been a tough trail. So, boys, get in here. I think we're just gonna hunker down here for the night. That's yeah, it's it's actually pretty cozy. Probably the safest bet. Um, yeah, you guys don't mind spooning, right? Oh yeah. No, that's my middle name. Okay, sweet. Getting a little facing north photo shoot in here. Dave looks very northern. It's a good look. Maybe the, the Northeast Bell Clava is going to be in the, uh, the mix next season. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely.
goes without saying, you'll have to head to Tyler's Instagram and check out whatever epic shot he manages to get out of this. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be better than mine. Uh. So a bear and a rabbit were out in the woods. The bear said to the rabbit, do you have problem with poop sticking to your fur? The rabbit said no. So the bear wiped his ass with the rabbit. <laughs> That's an Eddie Murphy so, joke. So. Just when we thought the journey was over, we come across Mr. Dave Andrews' vehicle. We tried to turn around down here at the end of the road, and I tried to see if Dave could come with us today, and it didn't work out. This is why, he had a gig. But turns out, Great minds think alike. So let's see what happens when we walk up this trail. We can sneak peek on a Dave Andrew engagement shoot. We can hear Dave. We can hear his big booming voice. What? Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> oh, this is really icy. <laughs> Yeah, don't go near the edge. <laughs> don't fall. I almost don't went here. into the drink. Well, looky here! Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Call Call here, good friends. We came down the road to turn around, and what did we see? A little what? Pajero. A little Pajero action. Yeah, we found Dave Andrew, and you know he's going to be <laughs> featured very soon. So, stay tuned. And look pretty. Just crashing into YouTube. Don't you love when it all works out? I mean, sometimes life is just beautiful. Is that too cheesy? 